A much-anticipated comet, Leonard, is likely to be 2021's best comet and its brightest comet by year's end. Astronomer Greg Leonard discovered the comet as 2021 began. Discovery images showed a tail for the comet, suggesting we might see a nice tail, as Comet Leonard draws closer to the Earth and Sun. The comet is currently heading sunward, toward its perihelion or closest point to the Sun on January 3, 2022. In December 2021, as Comet Leonard heads sunward, it'll sweep closest to Earth on December 13. It won't be particularly close at its closest, passing more than 21 million miles, 34 million km, away. But five days later, on December 18, the comet will have an exceptionally close pass of Venus of just 2.6 million miles, 4.2 million kilometers. Then it'll round the Sun on January 3, 2022, at a distance of about 56 million miles, 0.60, or 90 million kilometers. Please let us know what you think of our videos. Also, if you have not subscribed to our channel, Secrets of Space, please subscribe so that you get notified about our videos in future. How bright will Comet Leonard get? Will the comet get bright enough to see with the eye in December? It's possible that Comet Leonard might reach fourth magnitude before its early January perihelion. Comets are diffuse bodies, not pinpoints, so a fourth magnitude comet won't appear as bright to your eye as a fourth magnitude star. The star would be easily visible in a dark sky. The comet. At fourth magnitude, it would be a good binocular comet. It would be fun to see. Nature provides us with sky even once in a lifetime. Comet Leonard might be one of these, if it gets bright enough. Will you see this comet? This comet is initially in northern hemisphere skies. But it will become visible from the southern hemisphere in December 2021 and January 2022. An amazing feature of this celestial visitor is that it's an ultra-fast comet. It's traveling at 158,084 miles per hour, 254,412 kilometers per hour or 70.67 kilometers per second relative to Earth. What will Comet Leonard look like? When the comet reaches maximum brightness, it will have a dust tail and a gas tail. The dust tail will be shaped like a spike. This will happen because on December 8, the Earth will cross the orbital plane of the comet and observers will view the dust tail edge on. The viewing angle will cause the tail to narrow and brighten a bit. Comet Leonard has already grown a long gas, ion tail. It is now twice the angular size of a full moon. The direction of the dust and gas tails will be the same for most of the time the comet will be observable. Only in the period from December 10 to December 13, the two tails will form a visible angle that will not exceed 30 deg. The comet might also have an antitail that will seem to point in the direction opposite the other tails, towards the Sun. In fact, an antitail is an optical illusion that is created when we view larger dust particles deposited along the comet's orbit edge on. In the second half of December, the comet will move into the southern celestial hemisphere. On Christmas Day, December 25, Comet Leonard will be visible from the southern hemisphere in the constellation Microscopium. Please let us know in the comments what do you think of Comet Leonard. Thank you for watching.